Hi everyone. Um, I've been sort of inspired by Caligula with a nine to make a video, but um, as for who did what to who, I don't really care. Um, I don't like what Fringe Elements did to Brain Plays 2's channel, um, but this isn't about who did what to who and who's arguing with who about what and who's being stupid and who's doing this and that. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. If you're going to Skype me to talk about somebody else, nobody has, mind you, I'm not saying that anyone has, but if you're going to Skype me just to tell me who's did what to who, I don't care, okay? Don't. Yeah. If you're going to Skype me, it, do, do you have some something in mind? <laughs> Even if it's like fucking some movie you saw, or, you know, Maybe I got something completely wrong in, in a video and you want to tell me about it. Great, fine, but good gracious, I don't care who said what to who. Okay? Now, two two things that uh, Caligula said that I agree with. Um, one, we have a lot of people saying stuff about moral nihilism without knowing what moral nihilism is. And in fact, I just saw a video by abusive anti-theist who is arguing against somebody who is saying things about moral nihilism that just don't necessarily fly. Now, I I still have a hard time with the idea of moral nihilism. However, I'm not. I mean, it seems like it seems reasonable to me. It's not like I don't know. Um, it's not something that often left field or something. So. Now, down below, I'm going to put a wiki link down here. I, I think a lot of people, well, and basically moral nihilists do not believe in any moral systems. Um, even subjective moral systems aren't seen as true. Uh, even in the Wikipedia article, moral nihilism, or excuse me, moral nihilists are described as moral skeptics. Unfortunately, a lot of people have the view that nihilism translates to everything sucks, or something like that. Or everyone sucks, or something. Also, I think people have this misconception that if somebody says something like rape, something that offends a lot of us, nobody that I know wants to be raped, right? Um, if, if somebody says something like rape is not morally wrong, they are not then saying that rape is morally right, or that it, it or that it is acceptable, or that they even value a society where people are raping other people, and that the so society says that it is okay. Uh, to me, it looks like uh, moral nihilists are the atheists of. Um, morals, a moralists, if you will. Um, and then there are some other things in the Wikipedia article that talk. It talks about different kinds of moral nihilism, and I'm being skyped, so <laughs> I'm going to make this quick. Um, yeah. And the second thing I wanted to address is people being. Internet psychologist. Okay, first of all, sometimes a cigar is just a cigar. And I tend, I, on the whole, like Stephen Malinu, and I think that there certainly can be psychological reasons for, you know, think, or, or, or even psychoanalytic reasons for why people do what they do. Like somebody had a screwed up childhood and they felt powerless then, so now they're, you know, manipulative now because they want power because they never really had power as a child or something. I, I can see where people, you know, I, I can see where the psychoanalytic view might be correct in some cases. But I think many people blow certain psychological viewpoints way out of proportion and some people just over psychologize everything. Barack Obama says something stupid. Well, clearly he is suffering from. No, 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 no. 
That's, yeah. Um, and also, of okay, of course there are people who psychoanalyze their opponent because they don't have an argument, but they want to sound smart, so they're hiding behind a lot of psychobabble that they themselves don't even understand. Yes, that happens a lot. But I think you also have people that, you know, the, hell, I've read a Psychology 101 textbook, I've read a Sociology 101 textbook, right? I've, I've taken the classes. You know, and, and if somebody says a word like conditioning, I, I can see that. Uh, I might say something like, school conditions people to conform. Okay, fine. But give it a rest. <laughs> I, mean, I, I, I see some people just acting like, you know, they're, they're these, in, these experts in the field of psychology, 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 psychiatry, um, um, psych, you know, what, what's the word I'm looking for? Social psychology. Is neurophysiology da 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 da, and they're just running off the mouth like they know anything, and they really don't. You know, I mean, if you're just a vlogger and you're like, "Wow, man, I had this idea." Da 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 da. What if this is so? What if that's so? Da 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 da. I've I've rambled on about pantheism like that, but it's honest. It's like, "Hey, man, I had this wild idea. What if this is true?" Wow, well, that's neat. Or I was thinking about this, and I drew a parallel to this, and I drew and I drew some associations and I wonder what's going on here and maybe we should look deeper blah da 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 fine just please be honest you don't fucking know everything there is you know I mean if you're studying okay let's say you're in school you're studying philosophy and you're working at a fast food joint part time um I'm not gonna treat you like you have a PhD in psychology and you're not going to pass yourself off like you do so just chill, give it a rest, you don't know everything, relax, okay? Um, and, let's see, oh, okay, this is a pet peeve of mine, I don't get it much because I haven't been, say, diagnosed with a mental illness exactly, but, um, okay, a friend of mine uh, that I talked with on Skype is was diagnosed as schizotypal as well as diagnosed with a bunch of other things um, and he's been in the mental health in industry for a while um, but see I've gotten some of, some of this but he's gotten a lot more people for some reason assume that because they come out of the blue and know nothing of your situation but kind of have these theories that they they know what you should do, what you should stop doing, and what will somehow cure you, make you better. Just stop eating sugar, or stop eating MSG, or meat, or whatever they don't, whatever their pet taboo is, right? Or just meditate. Get off your meds, right? Or ADD doesn't exist, so you, 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 I don't know you from Adam, you, you need to get off your meds because the, the meds are actually making you, 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 get off your meds and if you say no, and if you, yeah you, think that the meds are working, it's because you're brainwashed by the psychological industry, you, yes you, I don't know you from shit, I don't care, I'm still gonna make these statements about you, you need to get off your medication, man, come on man, <laughs> No, um, and fuck, <laughs> and people prescribing like herbs and vitamins and everything. I mean, okay, so vitamins are healthy. I've started taking vitamins again. Oh, yay! But you know, you have people that will prescribe vitamins for somebody who's been <laughs> diagnosed as schizotypal. Really? I mean, come on, man. I mean, what? <sighs> I mean, it's, it's just a douchey move, you know? Or people who will say, oh, well, you can just cure cancer by going vegetarian. <laughs> okay, eating fruits and vegetables is good for your immune system. Mm -hmm. Yes, vitamins are good, fruits and vegetables are good, laying off the sugar is a good thing. Okay, but this it's not a cure for cancer. 
you know it's it, it's not a cure for what whatever if if you're if you were born with bad brain chemistry kind of like some people were just kind of born without a leg or something because shit happens eating healthy isn't just going to improve the brain chemistry and fix it it may improve it a little but it's not going to just fix up some condition boom 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 and I know I'm gonna get some con big pharma blah da 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 fuck fuck big pharma fuck the FDA fuck the drug war f it, it, fuck pseudoscience fuck it all fuck 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 okay uh yes fuck big pharma uh fuck the AMA fuck barriers to entry fuck it all fuck insurance companies fuck Barack Obama and Obamacare, fuck Nancy Pelosi, fuck them all, okay? Um, so no, I'm not like a supporter of Big Pharma or something like that, but <sighs> it, it really irks me. It's not like people go around the internet talking about, oh, actually, I have a better cure for your diabetes, da 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 and then and, and actually mean what they say. Oh, get off your insulin, because diabetes doesn't really exist, and all you need to do is meditate. You know, people don't do that. But with mental disorders, somehow people think that they have the, some kind of expertise or something. This. Okay, well, that's, that, that's my rant, my beef, my two cents. Um, Wikipedia link about more realism. See, because I'm like... Personally, I'd like the discussion about that to improve because I would like to learn more about it because I have more to learn and I'd love for the discussion to improve instead of just people making erroneous statements and then the other people coming back and saying, well, you're crazy and stupid. <laughs> Which, that's not entirely what they've done. I mean, they've backed up their argument, but it's not, but really, it's, come on, man, don't study what you're talking about, please. <laughs> All right, filler time. Do 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 do